What's up YouTube? Welcome to another video on the channel. Today we're doing a video with the Red Cat Volcano. Now, not this Red Cat Volcano that you just saw in the other video. That Red Cat Tornado. The EPX Pro 10th scale. Get ready guys, this one's gonna be fun. Red Cat came out with this redesigned um, Volcano EPX Pro. So this is a brushless 10th scale buggy. And if you can see, it's like the big brother of the 16th scale. So it's, it's crazy how much alike they look, but it's pretty awesome. So like I said, this is brushless. Just came out. As you can see, I got the copper color. It does come in a blue take this off I'll show you guys what's underneath I'm not gonna go into too many of the technicals because it's not necessarily my style but I want to show you guys this thing it's real interesting it's got two shocks per corner so I can't wait to send this thing off of off my ramp I got it set up in the distance there with a nice little feel you know brushless motor brushless ESC this can run 2s and 3s now I added these straps because when you go to put my 3s battery in here this that comes with it does not fit and i had this problem with my uh red cat um tornado because this is pretty much almost the same setup actually i'll uh i'll i'll try to post a picture of what my tornado looks like so you can see but this is pretty much the same um setup um that's in there so the 3S batteries couldn't fit in there, so I put these straps on underneath here. And all I did was take these screws, this screw, and that screw out. And then this whole part comes out here, and then I ran the, the straps underneath it. So no big deal, but it can run 2S and 3S. So we're going we're gonna to do that today. We're going to run it on 2S first for a speed run, and uh, 3S... Um, on the speed run as well and then we're gonna take it out into the field and send it off that ramp a couple of times and see how good it does hopefully you guys can see this but the GPS is set so we're gonna go ahead and do track start this is on 2s so I'm running the battery that comes with oh, trims a little off I'm running the battery that comes with the um, the tornado because this is a 2s battery that comes with the tornado so i am running that battery that comes with that car in here for this first run so let's see what we get 2s Woo. wait a minute hold on a second let's get to all right let's try this go back here we go That ain't bad. All right, see so what we got. Uh oh. What happened here? All right, so let's see, stop, read, 38 miles per hour. That ain't bad off of 2S, that's not bad at all. We're gonna go ahead and run that one more time though. We're gonna do start. Let me just see this one more time real quick. There we go. Too much, so we need to go this way. All right. Oof. All right, that's full throttle. Let's bring it back. Oh, 
All right, stop, read, 39, nice. All right, let me go put 3S in here. I got a feeling this thing's gonna be a monster on 3S. Let me go put 3S in here, I'll be right back. Start. Yes. Oh, it's doing wheelies now. Oh, this thing's gonna be a handful. All right. Here we go. Let's give it a whirl. Ooh. I had to get off it for a second. Oh man, that thing's coming in hot. All right. These tires balloon a lot. I'm seeing that. It's very slick. See if we can't. Woo! Save it. All right. That does not want me to get full throttle on 3S. We might have to try this on a different. As soon as I get on it, it wants to spin out. There's no wheelie bar in this thing either, but it looks like it wants to do wheelies right now. I'm trying to avoid messing it up already, but this thing is all over the place on 3S. Oh, there it is. First scratch. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got real quick. <laughs> oh man, all right. Let's see. Stop, read, 46. That's pretty good and I still wasn't all the way on it. Man, I might have to try some different tires. That thing flies. It's hard to control the thing in the grass. Man, that thing is moving. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. Right, Cat. That's what I'm talking about. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Well, that's not good. Oh. All right. That's popped out of there already. I don't know if you can see that in there. But that's popped out of that little cup right already the axles popped out of the cup so all right let me go and fix that real quick be right back all right we're back so all i had to do was take this one little screw out here and this whole thing bent enough for me to put that in there back in there so we're back in business These tires 
do not like this grass very much. I'm gonna have to get this thing in the dirt. As you can see it, I'm trying to get to the ramp, this thing is just tracking over weird. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Yeah, something's not right again. Oh, uh, yeah. Now you can see the other side has popped out all together. Wow. All right, so that's going to probably be... It looks like that's going to be a problem out the gate. Let me go back, see what I can do. All right, we're back. <laughs> no... Pretty good wheelie for no wheelie bar. So yeah, it's a little frustrating that I've had all these pro I've had these problems already in the first run with the drive shafts popping out, but before anybody goes and is like, oh man, it's trash. Let's remember that this is a 10 scale brushless buggy. I mean a uh, monster truck for I think it's only 230 bucks. And before anybody says, oh, Red Cat is paying you. I'm not getting paid by Red Cat. I ordered this with my own money. I just like to have things that I think are cool and cheap and share them with you guys. And this is one of them. Whew. That was my fault. That was a bad landing. But anyways, what I do know and I'll put that up here in this video too, is that this thing has, like I said, a lot of similarities to the volcano. I mean, the uh, tornado, which means that it shares a lot of the same parts. It means it shares a lot of the same upgrades um, that you can get from uh, Red Cat. And I've put quite a few of those already in my um, tornado. And I know how much that's helped that. So. I'll probably go ahead and do the same things with that. I completely missed. Probably go ahead and do the same thing with this thing too. Try to upgrade some stuff. And hopefully it'll be some more aftermarket stuff for this too. I don't know. If you guys know of anybody who does aftermarket stuff for Red Cat, let me know. So I like to check them out too. But so far for... For what I paid for it, I am not mad at this. These tires don't like this grass. <laughs> and I think drive shaft popped out again. It did. There it goes. <sighs> well, that stinks. It is bent already. Well, I try to I keep it real on this channel. It looks good, and I like it. You guys got a drive shaft issue. I mean, overall, I like the way it looks. I like, I like the the setup of it. It's like I said, it's like the the uh, tornado. It has potential. I mean, it's already eaten up in them cups but I can replace those with aluminum. Hey guys, I wanted to show it to you. And uh, you know, you'd be the judge, get it for yourself. Like I said, it's not too expensive. So, but it could get expensive if you gotta replace parts like crazy. This is the first run. I've done a couple of jumps. Mind you, they weren't good. I'm not saying that I landed it perfectly. I mean, part of this is gonna be on me too, but Anyways, guys, if you like this video, give me a like, give me a subscribe. I'll catch you guys on the next video. Peace.